This week at the Detroit Auto Show, Chevrolet unveiled the 2014 Corvette, the first all new redesign in nine years. big deal for GM, a company that's relying on the iconic Corvette to restore the public perception of the American auto industry. The price of the Corvette hasn't been announced yet, but you can expect it to start at around 50 grand, which is expensive, but cheaper than some of its European competitors. From the Corvette's introduction back in 1953, there have only been six other generations of the car. From the outset, the company played up the fun angle. The men who designed this had fun, and the builders and the testers had fun. I, for one, am going to have a lot of fun owning it. In 1963, Chevrolet introduced the Stingray Corvette, a name that's been resurrected with this latest model. Subsequent vets would adapt to their times. The 80s vet was super 80s. You've never seen anything like this before. A new Chevrolet Corvette like never before. Now, Corvette enthusiasts might take issue with the new square tail lights, but the car was designed to appeal to a younger, hipper demographic than the typical 50-year-old white male Corvette buyer. The Corvette is a notorious gas guzzler, and while this new redesign isn't going to get you access to the carpool lane, it is more fuel efficient than its predecessor and relies heavily on aluminum and carbon fiber. Last year, Chevy only sold around 12,000 vets, so they're hoping the redesign will rev up sales. Have they done enough? Well, let us know what you think at thelistshow.tv.